So we're seeing uh, Bankai with the ZSS pick, and I can understand why, because as we were talking about before, the movement from Pokemon Trainer is not great, and Gen with Fox, hell, Foxes in general, good Foxes in general, I think, will run circles around. I think it was actually because this may have been a double blind. Maybe. It may have been a double blind, because the the the, 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 ch the choice of of uh, Fox and um, ZSS to me suggests that um, they were kind of trying to counterpick each other. Um, I could still honestly see this as a response, because I don't yeah. feel like ZSS or Pokemon Trainer has any particular ops that would make it like, oh yes, definitely pick this character. Yeah. But I think they have different quirks that make the matchups function differently. For that sure. falls down to player preference. So... Grab punish. All right, All right. Bungay's coming pretty strong. 80% uh, to start and stuck off, but Fox is one of those characters that once you get put in disadvantage, uh, bad things happen. Yes, it's uh, sometimes a guessing oh. game, sometimes you just have to eat it. Neutral. Does, yep. neutral, neutral game. A little bit of a crouching there. Now, see, that's one of the things that I feel makes ZSS top tier is that she has a crouch. So, crawl. Yes, again. <laughs> so, so, crawl. A crawl, yeah. Well, isn't it really a crawl? Because she's prone. I suppose it would be a crawl. It's, it's, it's a crawl. All right. Anything Good if, if, if you can walk in crouch, it's a, it's, it's, a, it's a crawl. Yes. It's a crawl, friendo. But see, it's very top tier because she can move slow and look like she's BMing even when she's not. Yeah. yeah. Crawls are actually, like, extremely decent. Yes. Like, um, having a crawl depending on your character, because some characters don't really matter. If I'm a Wario and I'm crawling, who cares? I'm still, like, fat. Yes. Um, however, if I'm a Wii Fit Trainer or if I'm ZSS crawling, I shrink my hurt box a whole lot. Yes. Even though I... Nice. Wow, they Bankai has come out that. super strong. Bankai doing pretty good on this one. All right, doesn't hit by the up smash. So Jen likes to look for those at these sorts of percents, just the raw up smashes because they're kind of hard to punish. Wow. Okay. Nice punish on block. That jab is really plus. Uh, S fat taunt, or really minus rather. The S yeah. fat taunt. The uh, taunt like is it. very minus, very yeah. minus. <laughs> All right, goes for the grab, but gets nice. beat up okay. by the jab. So, I think so that jab is still frame one. Yeah, so, yes, it is. But um, Bankai had good recognition there because he understood that Jen was going to hold block until the last one uh, that time because that's how he got punished to the last time. So that time he only did jab one, two, and then waited and then dashed back. So got a little bit of a punish. Bucket doesn't go for up beat. Like, ever. Of, I, I, I wouldn't blame him because um, Fox being the fast faller that he is, uh, and being very small and very light, means that there's a chance that he can jank his way out of an up beat. Not by purpose, but just because up beat seems to be a lot less consistent. Fantastic punish. A recognition on the, uh, on the flip kick. Um, very good call out on that one. All right, tries to flip flick. Kind of gives up the stage nice, there, but gets the it. foot steal. Foot steal, foot school. Nice. Of feet, uh, that, that was pretty strong showing. Jen was yeah. making his way back towards the end, but Bankai seemed to have a, a commanding... Uh... He had a good understanding. I think he had a very good understanding of how uh, that matchup functions. I feel like he, he knew when he was going to be plus. He knew when he was minus. He knew when he was safe. He knew when he was allowed to pressure Fox and when he had to chill for a little bit. Mm -hmm. I feel like that was just... He played it very methodically. And with the counter pick, especially, uh, if this wasn't a double blind, but a genuine counter pick, um, I can see that being doubly true. Yeah. In the sense that he understands the matchup and he understands why it isn't good or so good for him as a Pokemon trainer. Why it could be good for the way he plays against us. All right, so spacing almost seems there is to start. Goes for an up smash, which is a little bit of a hard read this early on, especially when Fox can get some serious percent on you. 46. All right, yeah, just a couple with the jab. Nice reset by Jen. That's like that's some melee stuff right there. Dare resets on the platform. I like it. Falling there, gets parried on it. Can't look forward too often, because Jen is on deck with his parries. He is super good about it. All right, good falling up there through the platform and still converts off of it. Bit of a scary place for Jen, but he doesn't get punished for that. Up smash, out of shield, will punish. All right. Falling up there. All right. Up B was a little risky, but recovers the platform, and Jen doesn't want to chase it too badly. In. Too far in. Higher percent. Oh, Reflector's not going to do anything at that point. All right. All right. Um, so, yeah, yes. really solid uh, start by uh, by Jen. Uh, Bakai did a really uh, good job bringing it back, though. So, I'm uh, anticipating uh, continued adaptation from Bankai. Ooh. We also saw uh, 
see, we're seeing occasional flubs like that. Like, that grab was probably a re... Sometimes you just gotta when do it, it. When in doubt. When is Jen gonna get when sponsored by Nike? Just do it. Hold these sneakers. Sh I like that. Sneakers. <laughs> I'll start sneakers. <laughs> I was talking about that with Jewel. Are we just gonna put sh in front of everything now? Sh sneakers. My scounter pick is My gonna be bad. Yeah. It's like how I said uh, a sh little bit. It's a sh little bit. Still gets um, the upside. Uh, speaking of a sh little bit, uh, Jen is definitely a sh little bit nice. Uh, uh, get body. Wait, really? Get, that killed him? Get schmixed. Show sh going shin shdish shnex Okay, now, now you need to stop. What? Yeah, I do need to stop. That's probably a good vocal exercise. All right. All right, so we're going into game three on this one. Uh. See, I want to say, I want to try to talk about, like, what Bonkai could have adapted to and done there. Jen just up smashed at the right time. Yeah, I mean, look, there's not there's not a whole lot else to Jen, say. Uh, okay, Fox on Battlefield for one is terrifying. Yes. Like, um, oh, and we're seeing a switch. Okay, so yep. we're seeing a switch. Uh, see, I'm sure that this is because of uh, locking Jen into Fox. He gets the stage counter pick, and he has a little bit of a download on how Jen wants to play, which is a good way to counter pick as any. Uh, nice big punish. Uh, the, the, this is where you're seeing like the recognition of someone who plays Fox a whole lot. Because um, you saw Tilde earlier, and he up tilted and then did a fair immediately afterward without it even going into tumble. But Jen knew his percents exactly. He says, I can up tilt, up tilt, second one's going to put in a tumble, and I get a follow up. Mm. All right. Keeping him off stage. Good Down there. Yep. Good night. You're Fox. You're dying. Lizard on. Uh. <laughs> Up smash? Oh, no, up beautiful air. read. He's, he has done a super solid job of recognizing the defensive habits of Bankai and punishing super hard accordingly. Yep. So actually goes for the spot dodge there in response, trying to expect something after that, but gets hit by the Nair cross up on shield. Oh, oh excuse me? Going for a ride? Excuse me? We're going on a wild ride. Uh, All right. Back on block. Yeah, that was very... Well, that was a punish situation. I don't know if uh, Ivy Sword can get a grab off of that. No edge guard from Fox. A lot of armor on that move, so it's kind of scary to challenge. All right, Put him drag. Nice. Good response Good reaction. to the Nair. Nice, nice reaction. That was punishment. fantastic reactions, yeah. actually. Um, because the thing is with Charizard Nair, it's not safe at all on the sour hit. But if you space it on the sweet hit, it is safe. Yes. Um, uh, the sweet hit is right at the beginning or right at the end. I forget. It's actually not time based. It's on the tip of his tail. Oh, I see. Yeah. So if you do tipper, space, space out, you're safe. God. Otherwise, it is usually pretty darn minus. Yes. Speaking of minus, we're going to have to see some clean uh, Razor Blade plays on this one. Drop in there. Joink. Yep. Snap the, Very, very low risk to go for those. Yo, resets him. Gives him the headbutt. Devin, an audible ooh. So, that was nice. Uh, we're looking potentially. That's a mix. Bankai getting some Squirtle combos right here. Yeah, chasing Bankai, down. Man, I have not seen him play this well. The Lima Twitter has gotten him tight. The Twitter situation, he's like, I am I am winning this tournament. It's over. He's ready for it, and he's looking at a percent now. Setups from Ivysaur are going to look really scary. Yeah, I mean. All right. That, that, again, that, that kind of. Up air strings are the nice. way to start. The, the patience from Jen's been super good on, the, on those. Uh, All right. Yo, is Bonkai going to mash it out? Yeah. Are we going to see Dude, Jen, it? Jen has been looking for it. See, because Jen's going to have the punish ready. Oh, that could have been death. Not only did he oh, have the that wait. dead quiet. Oh, dead quiet. Ah! Oh, oh, no, to get he a, wants it. Jenny still needs to get he a stop, wants though. It. Oh, my God, no! Up smash, smash, baby. Says, I can mash up smash, too. Says, don't land on Says, don't land on says, can we get can we get someone else on the mic? Can, can I not have to deal with this? First, he's a Zelda player. Then he's then he starts speaking French to me.